So here it is guys, I just got done unboxing all the stuff that came in the box for the Eskimo Sierra Thermal 2-man eye set. Looks like we're going to have a lot of assembly to do. But uh, here's some of the frame over here. Got the uh, square bars with the push buttons, support poles, the two folding chairs, the uh, outside of the hut right there. Looks like some brackets and there's the inventory list, instruction manual, the gasket. So step one was to bolt on these uh, brackets to the sled. So I got those two on there. I used a uh, 7 16 ratchet and a wrench to hold it on there. All right, on to step two. Step two is just bolting on this piece of metal into the sled. Two bolts on each side. And uh, I just used the ratchet and the wrench again. Alright guys, the third step was to assemble these. I think these are the chair mounts. Just had to put four bolts on them and tighten them. Alright guys, for the fourth step, all we had to do was... Uh, Attach these with these pins. See that? All right, guys, just got done with step five. And that was to attach the swivel mounts to the chair. Just four bolts on each one, holding it on. And so we're gonna attach it to the base. Well, guys, I just ran into my first problem when I was uh, attaching the swivel mount. I put the bolts in the wrong way. The uh, it should be going, it should be flipped around because now that's going to run into uh, the head of the bolt and it won't swivel. So, just going to have to fix that, not a big deal, but yeah. Just got the seats mounted. Ran, ran into a little problem, but uh, wasn't too big of a deal. Just had to take the swivel back off. But, uh, pretty cool. Take a chair out. Have a one-man sled. That's cool. Alright, on to the next step. Alright guys, so for step seven we need to drill these self-tapping bits into this rail. For that I'm just using my cordless drill. And, uh, apply a little bit of pressure to it. That's all, and then just gotta do this to, uh, I think there's four support rails and that's it. All right guys, I got all those uh, support poles put together. And uh, in that clip you saw when I was drilling in the uh, screws, I had my drill on the lower speed, so it took a little longer. So once I turned it up to speed two, it went a little quicker. And uh, yeah. Alright guys, step 8 is finished, just bolted these on, it's coming along, just been using the uh, ratchet and the little extender was helpful on that, and the wrench. Alright guys, we got the frame all installed, just took a little while, that all ready, but. I think the instructions were kind of hard to follow at this point. Uh, and it doesn't show too well. I'm assuming that's supposed to go down farther, but I can mess with it later. Uh, yeah. Just got the cover put on. It's looking good. Probably could be fitted on there a little better, but. The zipper is really good quality. Uh, just 
pockets. A lot of space in here. Window flaps, got air vent on the top. Comes with three support poles. Yeah, I think that's about it. Thanks for watching and uh, have a good eye fishing season. All right guys, so all I used to put this together was my drill, a wrench, and a ratchet with uh, 7 sixteenths. Yep, that's it.